also the VFW commander in Milford. And he's here to present the <laughs> DOD lapel pins. Steve, it's yours. Thank you very much. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Good morning. Something, something I have to get off my chest right now before I even start. Good morning, Vietnam! <laughs> I wanted to say that for about three weeks. <laughs> I got it off my chest. Welcome to all of you Vietnam veterans and Vietnam era veterans here today. I want to let you know that what I'm doing today is a privilege and honor for me to do. I am myself and my committee who incidentally put together the thing up at the DCU. I'm over the head. That's it. Uh, are with me today. I have two members here today. One, Earl Fahey and Frankie Earl. They will be, be coming to your table to present you with the pin after I let you know what you're going to be getting. And uh, we want you to either raise your hand or stand if you can for each table so that we can distribute the pins to you. All right, so I'm going to let you know now what you're going to be getting. The United States of America, Vietnam, Vietnam War Commemoration, excuse me, a lapel pin. Purpose of the pin, to recognize, thank, and honor the United States military veterans who served during the Vietnam War. Eligibility, living United States veterans who served on active duty in the United States Armed Forces at any time during the period of November 1st, 1955, <coughs> until May 15th of 1975, <coughs> regardless of the location, if you were in Germany, Italy, I don't care, if you were in the bracket between November and May, you're eligible for the pin. These pins will be presented in a dignified manner to each Vietnam veteran during public events held in their community by a commemorative partners, which we are with partners with the Department of Defense. And you can see the flag behind us. <coughs> and we should thank you for your service and sacrifice. And if there's anybody that you know uh, in a nursing home or anything like that that can't make the event, then we will go out of our way to present one to them in their uh, location. The symbol. When you receive the pin, the eagle on the pin represents honor and dedication to our nation as one of the most recognizable and notable American symbols. It rises with distinction on numerous military insignia. It has a blue circle. The color blue matches the canton of the American flag and signifies vigilance, perseverance, and justice. <laughs> the circle shape of the blue color also matches the official seal of the commemoration of the Lord of the Service. The law will reap a time-honored symbol representing victory, integrity, and strength. The stripes, the stripes behind the eagle represent the American flag. The stars, the six stars represent two. The six allies who served, sacrificed, and fought alongside one another. Australia, New Zealand, the Philippines, the Republic of Korea, Thailand, the United States, and our friends in South Vietnam who fought along with us. The message, the grateful nation thanks and honors you, is embossed on the back of the uh, pin closest to your heart. So when you put this on, either wear it on the left-hand side of your cap or on the left lapel. And now, I'll ask my committee men to pass some venture forward and pass out him. On behalf of our nation, I am privileged to present to you with this lasting memento of your nation's thanks. The nation, Commonwealth, and all who are here Thank you for your dedicated service and the personal sacrifice, both of you and your family, you for all of us during the Vietnam Thank War. Thank you very much. You're very welcome. For this, I salute you all.